<coughs> Hello, my name is David, and I'm going to make a vlog about why I still stick with iPods over listening to music over smartphones to this very day. So here we go. So ever since 2003, when I entered high school, my I got my first iPod. It was an iPod mini at the time, and it was very pixelated, 8-bit, you said the well, but no videos yet. Um, and as the, as a year or two went past, I upgraded to an iPod Video, then an iPod Classic, then an iPod Touch, then a next 6th gen iPod Touch, 64 gigabyte, and now I have this, a 128 gigabyte iPod Touch I purchased recently, and I still use iPods to this very day. And I'll tell you why why I listen to music with still with iPods more than your smartphone. So, anyways, the reason why I still use an iPod is because I like listening to music and watching videos without wasting data. There's Wi-Fi options, but that's for people who want to stick with internet connection with cell phone service everywhere to go, which raises the phone bill up on your family plan. Depending on what your family plan is, your parents are gonna be cheap, some of them. And with apps like Spotify, Pandora, and other music streaming services, I just don't wanna pay 10 bucks a month for something that I barely use. Like this smartphone right here, I use it for YouTube and contacting friends and family and other stuff. And some sites like Facebook to catch up with old friends from my, from the past. So that's all I usually use my smartphone for. And with my iPod Touch, I store music and mostly TV shows. I got like three TV shows on there. South Park, Robot Chicken, and Mike Tyson Mystery is a new one I took a liking to years ago. And it's really funny. So, if any of you out there still use a smartphone to stream your music, some of you might want to go back to an iPod if you don't want to waste your data plan or rates. So, anyways, take my message. Some of you out there use an iPod Touch more than a smartphone or wasting your data or data plan or minutes. Anyways, I'm D David Cass. Peace out. Bye.